So from, yeah, basically from that side. So all, wow, yeah. And then, you know, all the way, all the way there will be, will be packed. Okay, Fredrik, welcome to Hammarby. Thank you. How do you feel now that you are officially a Hammarby player? I feel really good. Uh, it was some uh, hectic days, uh, the last couple of days, so uh, it's really nice that everything worked out uh, and that I can finally sit here uh, and be a Hammarby player. What went through your mind uh, when you first heard that uh, Hammarby uh, was interested? I got really excited, to be honest. Uh, of course, as a Danish guy, a Danish football player, you know uh, the Swedish league and uh, of course you know Hammarby as well. Uh, it's a big club in Sweden. Um, so I, I, I was really really excited uh, when I first heard about uh, the interest from, from Hammarby. Um, and uh, yeah, I was really won it also and uh, was really uh, yeah, pleased to hear about the interest. You had your breakthrough at uh, Lyngby as a teenager and uh, before securing a move to Augsburg in the Bundesliga. Since then you've been on loan in uh, Brøndby, big club in Denmark and uh, now uh, in Portugal. Uh, why did you feel like Hammarby was a good step for you, uh, your next step in, the, in your career? Yeah, it's no secret that I've been a bit around uh, the last, was that, uh, one and a half years something. Uh, so I also felt like uh, the interest from Hammarby and Hammarby uh, as a club. Uh, I could feel also that it's like a, more like a family club also. Uh, it's maybe also a bit closer culture-wise uh, than Portugal was uh, for me. Uh, you can, uh, yeah, of course when it's Scandinavian it's a bit more what I'm also used to and what I came from uh, in Denmark. Uh, so I felt like the the opportunity to go to Hammarby and feel a bit more at home uh, was also a very nice and important step for me as a as a person, but also as a football player, of course. You hadn't been in Stockholm before, so what do you look forward forward to in uh, you know experiencing this new city? Yeah, I really look forward to exploring the city as well. I've only heard uh, good things about it uh, from many many people, uh, but never been here, never got the chance to to come here. Uh, so yeah, just uh, looking forward to to see the city and I heard also that uh, when the sun comes a bit, uh, the city gets even nicer. Yeah, that's correct. But you came to the most important part of the city straight away, uh, near Sade Stadion. Yeah. So that's perfect. I know that you've seen uh, clips of uh, Hammarby supporters on, on YouTube. Um, yeah, what do you feel about playing in front of uh, our supporters? I really look forward to it. Uh, it's a big part of football fans uh, and uh, you should really appreciate also uh, having fans and uh, having fans like uh, Hammarby has is uh, it's not every club that has has it like that. Uh, so I really look forward to to come to the stadium and uh, say hello to everyone and uh, yeah, can't wait to to play there uh, in front of them uh, as well. So you're a central defender. What kind of uh, central defender are you? Uh, what are your strengths on the pitch? I would like to see myself as a centre back who likes to uh, to build the game up uh, from the back, to find solutions, both uh, short short uh, solutions, but also longer solutions, uh, depending on the game, depending on the the opponent also, uh, and the yeah possibilities to uh, to play. Uh, You're quite tall. I'm also quite tall. I also think I have some strength in the in the defensive uh, aerial duels in the air, um, and uh, then I also really enjoy defending. So uh, yeah, I like both parts of the game. The season is uh, coming up very soon. Uh, feels like you're ready to play on Sunday. How do you feel coming into the team so so late in the preseason? I feel fine about it. Uh, of course, it would also be nice to have had. Uh, uh, lots of trainings with the guys, but yeah, that's not how it is right now. Uh, so, uh, and that's also football uh, being ready uh, whenever the opportunity comes. Uh, that's also what you work for. Uh, even though I wasn't here, uh, I've still kept myself going and uh, been training and uh, yeah, uh, ready for whatever comes. Uh, now this opportunity comes, so 
uh, maybe it's not uh, optimal, but then it's about making the most optimal out of the situation you're in. I'm ready uh, to play games. Uh, my physical shape is, uh, is good. Uh, no injuries uh, and uh, I'm ready. Have you had a chance to uh, speak to Kim? I've also spoken to, uh, to Kim uh, earlier today. Uh, had a great uh, talk about uh, football, how uh, he sees football, how he sees the... Today was pretty much only the defending part, uh, which is also maybe the most important. Mats Fenger får ge dig lite svenska lektioner. Stort tack och återigen uh, varmt välkommen till Hammarby. Tack. I've seen it uh, both on YouTube and uh, I don't know Instagram, everything, yeah. uh, pictures, videos. So uh, high expectations, but uh, I think it can uh, live up to it. Thank you.